Hello my darlings and welcome back to San Myshuno. We are at San Myshuno Park for the final ever time today. Last time we started the exterior to the wedding venue area and today we're going to finish it off by cracking on with the interior and having a final tour of the park itself. So let's get to it. Happy Wednesday my lovely lovelies and welcome back to Let's Build the World. And welcome to the final part of San Myshuno Park. We are complete. We are done with it. All we've got left to do today is figure out the interior to the wedding venue. And then we're going to have a nice big tour of the park and just see everything that it's got to offer. And that's us done. That is us done. And that is us moving on to the Optown area of San Myshuno, which I'm very excited for. Now, I need to remind us that we've still got a couple of places we're going to be renovating for San Myshuno. If you remember Lorena and Dorothy back at Carl Pepper House, they have just moved into a townhouse that we're going to be developing. I'm going to do that as like a little bit of a speed build video. So it's going to be a little bit different. So be on the looks out for that soon as well. So because that's what's going to happen yesterday. Anyway, so here we go. I want to work out i want to get so i do want to do some landscaping in here i think we'll, what we're going to do is play around with the terrain paint first and just bring in some soil just for the edges here i'm going to make that a little bit bigger a little bit softer and just bring in some soil down on this part here in fact i think i should go a little bit bigger and then just go in like that that's better yeah and then bring it down and then taper it out just at the edge, just so it's not so thick there. Yeah, I might even just bring a little bit more around to that side as well. And the same with this. So if I can bring it to there and then taper it down, let's just do that for the beginning and then bring that up a little bit wider there. Yeah, but this is making me want to go a little bit wider here as well now. And I do want to get some kind of landscaping in that, like down on this point here. So that is what we're going to do. Um, it doesn't really matter if it's like going into this area, if you know what I mean. If it's like going through onto the other point. Oh, it kind of does. <laughs> it kind of does indeed. So we need to be a little bit careful about that then. Making sure that it's not going to be poking through the roof points. So again, using the same... Uh, does that matter there? Yep, that does. Uh, using the same grass that I've used on the outside. I'm just going to litter it all the way down either side. So the grass is down each side now and that's made a real nice difference to me i've also pulled out these orb lights you wait we're going to be doing something with them and um, we need to get in some more of this greenery as well now then so if i can whiffle some into here again i'm going to be using all different kind of like sizes just to make it look all natural or as natural as possible uh i'm gonna flop a fewer on this side one then one around there as well and we'll do the same coming down from this way as well. Where do we start you? We're going to do you a little bit higher this time then. So around about there. Need to be careful that I am not going into the wall. Nope, we're fine. Okay, more of this down here. Oh, I just think this would be a lush vibe to have a wedding in. <gasps> Very much feeling it. I really am. Um, Kind of glad that we went or I forgot about the idea of having kind of like a recreation sort of museum area. It just wouldn't be usable. I'd rather have a usable area, you know, for the Sims. So that's what I'm doing. That is indeed what I'm doing. What other plants can I get in here? Oh, maybe some of these. Maybe some of these lovely little ferns. Flop a few of these down as well. So one there. Let's size them down as well. The more we're coming down. Um, Another one here as well, right next. Let's, oh, size you down twice here. Little one there. Beautiful little number here as well. And a little one down on this side here. Let me see this, please. Yes, feeling it. And the same with this. So, burn there. These last two parts have just been me landscaping. But that is the way that it goes, you know. We're finally finished, though. I'm very excited about it. The only thing I found is in gameplay, not a lot of Sims come here. For some, because this, like, because with the Central Park areas... They've got so much around here and they've also got like a barbecue. They've got like the basketball court, a children's play area. They've got a, yeah, the barbecue area here. They more along, they just stay around this part. It's very annoying. Um, I don't like that. It makes me fume. Look at this beautiful park and you're choosing to stay around the outskirts. <sighs> annoying, but you know, Sims, what more can be said? Um, I think I want to get in some of this grass as well. Yeah. 
Yeah, we'll get in some of this. In fact, I'm just going to go for the darker grass. We've got, oh, is that the darker one? No, this one here is. Let me see this actually. Yeah. Mm, yeah. <laughs> me second guessing everything I do because I am a Virgo. Right, I'm going to put this to here. Bring it down here as well. I could probably, uh, is that going to creep through the other side? No, it's not, but it, no, that's fine. I was going to say it looks weird cutting in, but it's fine. It's absolutely fine. Same here as well. Another little one there. Little moment. Same down here. Beautiful. Oh, um, is there anybody out there who's going to be playing Starfield? I know I mentioned Starfield in the last video, but I'm very interested if anybody out there is going to be playing Starfield. Please let me know down below. Um, I'll be very interested. Very interested to know who is going to be joining me on a space adventure. And if you are, then please tweet me your characters because I love to have a nose of what other people's characters and stuff. Feel free. <clears throat> yeah, lovely. And then I think just to bring in that park element, I am going to add a bit of this spiky, uh, drier looking grass into here as well. Not loads of it, just a little cluster here and there, I think. Little one there. Let me see this. Yes. And the same down here as well. Let's just plop a little moment in there like that. Oh, you're a bit dominating actually. Let's size you down twice on these parts. Um, one there. And a little cluster next to it there. Beautiful. And the same over on this side here as well. So one of these down here. Beautiful. Another little cluster there. Stunning. One, two of these down here, please, if you will. Thank you. Beautiful, beautiful. Let's spin you around to there. And we'll finish off with just a little one there like that. <laughs> yeah, that's really nice. I like that. Gonna keep the grass as it is as well. Very perfected lawn here. Don't want to do a striped lawn. Ooh, what would that look like? Let's have a look. Let's have a little look at a striped lawn moment. Eh, I don't really like it. I think it looks better with just with the normal grass underneath of it. So I'm going to keep it as it is. Yeah, that was better. That's much better indeed. Okay, so here we go. We need to start figuring out a plan with the seats. I'm going to pop two. I'm probably going to do like rows of two and three, depending on how thicker it gets. So is that too close? No, that's fine. Let's get the grid on though so I can see where I am actually putting these. Uh, you were there. You were there like that. Is that right? That indeed is. I'm going to put pop poop. I'm going to poop. I'm just going to poo. I'm just going to do a little pub poo on the floor if you don't mind. Um, I'm going to pop these in three here, I think. One, two, three. Look. Is that wide? Is that too wide there? No, that's fine. Uh, same here as well. One, two, and a three. Same here too. One, two, three. <clears throat> Sorry. Still got this cough. Um, and I nearly choked then. One, two, three. Yep, this is working out wonderfully. Really is. I mean, this wouldn't be the perfect pla Well, you could. You could decorate this for the... Um, so they could eat and stuff here as well. I'm not going to do that personally. I'm just going to have it as it is. But feel free, my darlings. Feel free to do whatever the hell you want with this. The choice is yours. Is this is this correct? Yes, it... Well, no, actually. You need to come in one to be the perfect. There we go. Beautiful. Same here as well. And going down here. Oh! I bet someone noticed that and they were fuming. I know what you lot are like. Eagle eyes, my loves. Eagle eyes. The, the, the majority of this is all... Th uh, Three. Three wide chairs. And do you know what? I'm fine with that. I think I'm, I'm not going to go down any more. Oh, let me just have a look what you're going to... Yeah. Yeah, I'm not going to go down any more than that. I like the black as well. It's a juxtaposition against the green. I do like it. But I do want to get some white elements in here. And by use of this, these wonderful little globes that I love. Uh, I think I'm going to put a few of these in different sizes everywhere but I definitely want to do one here do I want to make it a little bit more like this just so it's not the same as the the other one yeah I think I do rather than it yes yes that's nice and then I'm going to bring some of these down and pop these in all of the areas where the seating is but really nestled up against the greenery uh just the, the light that these give off. They're so cute. They really, really are. Maybe we could do like a little cluster of 
two here and there as well. I'll do another two here. Just pop you on the other side. There we go. Oh, yes. And then over on this side here, we're going to do one there. In fact, I'm going to do a cluster of two here. Beautiful. Oh, nope, nope, nope. That's too big. These are going to be smaller than the ones at the front. Okay. This is just this. Uh, you, you wait. It looks lovely at night. It really does. And I only tested one as well. So I'm wondering what it's going to look like with all of these. I did bring out some candles as well. I don't know if I want to use candles or not. But I think this is going to be enough. Just having the balls. These orbs everywhere. I think it will really be effective. This size you down as well. And I think I want to do a cluster right at the entrance. Like here. Default size. You there. And then a little, another one there. Oh, and then one there. Size another one down. Flop it on this side. And then do a little tiny one on that side there like that. Let me see you. Oh, I do like that. Look at night. Look. Look at that. Oh, it's very cute, that. I do like that indeed. That looks lovely. Yeah, I'm very, very into that. <laughs> I'm very into that, I am. Okay, that's lovely. Lovely, lovely, lovely. So, I think what I'm going to do now is try and find some green planters that I think would just go well in here. And I think we're going to be done. Much shorter part today, but we're going to have a nice big tour around the actual park itself. So, that is going to take up quite a bit of time. So, let me try and find some planters. Hmm. Planters wasn't working, but I pulled out this. I wasn't going to do any flowers here, but for some reason, I just think this like blush pink tone looks great. So I think I want to get this in. I might size them down just so they fit in here a little bit better and put them on either, either side. Oh, I do like that. Yes, we'll do that on either side. Can we get a better position with that? No, okay. And I've pulled out these hanging vines because we're going to decorate this area up a little bit more with those. Um, if I can just flop them in either side here, just so they look a little bit uh, different on either side there. Yes, nice. Like that. Okay. And then I want to hang a few of these vines, maybe at the back of the, at the back of here. Let's size you down and then lift you up. Oh, I do like that. Yes. And then I was thinking about using these. Why is this not moving? Okay. <laughs> there we go. Can I not, can I not tilt you? Oh, I thought I could do that manually. I can do it with the tool mod, but I'm not going to. <laughs> I can do it with the tool mod, but I'm not going to is my mantra. Because I just, I just can't. I can't. I know we're like swallowing, swallowing? What is a swallop? I know we are swallowing up that view from behind it, but as long as you can see like hints of water, and I prefer it being all kind of like, oh, I'm full that loves. I think that would make a wonderful wedding venue. I just wish that this was black underneath of here. If this was black underneath of here, apart from that white, that the default ugh, under the roof line, it would have just pulled it all together so much better. But, you know, Sims, we've got to make do with what we've got. I think that's wonderful. I'm happy with that. I don't know about you lot, but I'm here for that. Very much here for that. What does it look like at sunset? Oh, I mean, I'd get married here. I don't know about you. But I know I would, and I don't want to get married. Um, <laughs> there we go. Stunning. Okay. Beautiful. My loves, we are finished. We are complete with San Marjuno Park. Oh, I've had fun doing this. I really, really have. I do love doing community lots. Really, really do. Okay. Well, let's get into live mode, and let's get some sims in here. And we'll have a big tour around the whole park. So here we are, my darlings, at San Marjuno Park. This was a labour of love, and I did enjoy doing it. I really did. There's a few sims near playing on the swings and whatnot, but as I said, they don't tend to come here for some reason. Anyway, so front entrance. We've got a little bike park area up there, a little seating area. We've got steps up onto the skywalk here where you can come and just take in the view. Oh, Look at the sun setting and whatnot. It's going to be dark in a minute, so I need to get on with this, <laughs> this um, tour. Did forget what it was called then. So the skywalk just takes you all the way around. You can sit and enjoy and smell all the greenery. 
in an otherwise very, very hefty cityscape. Very nice indeed. So back through this way, let's go to the front again. Walk all the way along here. Oh, it's going to be wonderful at night around here. It really is. Um, Little children's park down there. We'll get to that point, don't you worry. Little telescope to watch all the world go by. Um, You can come this way if you are um disabled or you have a pram there is a little walkway a little sloping area that you can come and use down this way we've got ourselves a little barbecue area that the sims do not come to <laughs> um but it's got a huge under under cover barbecue area little fountain there as well wonderful um, all with living roofs to attract all the bees and the insects and whatnot. Um, there are toilets here as well. There's two toilets here, one toilet there and a disabled toilet here, plus a little um, changing unit. What else have we got around here? I can't really remember. It's, that, it's been that long since I've been here. Um, a little, a little uh, photo booth. We've got vending machines over in this area here as well. Wonderful. And you can come through into this bit here. This is the children's park area. Lovely, lovely, lovely stuff. Oh, 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 well, hello. Someone's finally coming. Um, A children's sand pit. Sand pit over in this area here where the toddlers and stuff can hang out. Got a little coffee bar area there as well. Um, Splash pad. That My sim is just weirdly just standing and doing nothing too. I've also put dog... Ball, bowls everywhere throughout the park very dog friendly park dogs are allowed anywhere here and um, we've got the park cafe that um no one is in once again <laughs> we've got kitchen in here as well plus a toilet in this area too oh rather nice indeed um what we got going around here oh we got the community garden area as well sprouting all kinds of good stuff i do not want it to be cloudy is it going cloudy or is it just going dark i think it's going dark um, we'll wait until the lights come up. We'll wait until the evening drops then before we go to the bit that we've just done. Um, just so it looks lovely lit up at night. And it's night time. It's night time. We've got the downstairs area of the park here. So into the basement where it's got multiple areas where you can get down into. A little stage area that I did make sure had some cover as well. Just in case like things underneath got wet. I did put a podium down there as well. Podium where they can come and do speeches and whatnot. But yeah, gorgeous. And then we've got the whole kind of like sand sculpture area. Lots of places for your sims to sit out and eat. Um, an outdoor gym area. We've got more toilets down here on that side there. Uh, we've got areas where your sim can come and play chess. All covered up as well. We've got a little mural area, which is wonderful. Um, I made sure that Theodore came down and did all that, if you remember Theodore. Another little area to get up to there. We have got like a little janitor's room as well, which I've put in some like, well, I think I showed you. I think I showed you what I put in there. Can we get down to this level, please? Yeah, there we go. So it just looks like the park's kind of like powered. I thought that was a nice little touch. Nice little touch and do. Anyway, we're just going to skip right through there. We're going to go up in the lift. We're going to go up in the lift. Oh, there we are. Up to this level. And this is your little wedding venue. Oh, imagine underneath of the stars in here. I'm for that. I really am. Very, very much for that vibe. I think that'd make a lovely thumbnail to finish off, don't you? Oh, I do. Yes, that'd be a lovely thumbnail. Let's do it now. Let's take a thumbnail. And then you'll know what the thumbnail is going to be. But yeah, I don't think I've missed anything out. Cafe, Skywalk, Stage. I think we got everything, loves. We definitely got everything, but I will get this up on the gallery. I will get this up on the gallery for you all to go and enjoy, even though no Sims come to this place. Um, <laughs> so that's pretty annoying. And I can't change the venue to a park either. So Sims, oh, there is a Sim. Oh, what are you doing? Splash padding, probably. Anyway, we're done. I will be back next week with more Let's Build the Worlds. We're going to be into the Uptown area, which I'm very excited about. But I'm also going to be bringing a speed build out of me renovating the lots that we haven't um, finished for this save file yet. So be on the looks out for it, my darlings. Thank you so much for watching. Leave me some lovely comments and I'll see you all again tomorrow. Goodbye.